Hi everyone, it's Grandma Jackie. I am back and I've got another Dollar Tree haul. Um, I just got off work on working the night shift. I haven't done a haul in a couple days because I've been working some different shifts and had to have time to go shopping too. So um, I got off work and I kind of don't know if I'm going to lay down and nap during the day today because I have to go back to work um, at 2.30 in the afternoon and pick up my check. <laughs> and you can only get it then. You can't show up whenever you're not working to get it. You have a set time to get it or you have to get it the next time you're working or they'll mail it to you because of the whole deal. They don't want a lot of pe people traffic in the building that doesn't have to be. Which I don't blame them. So I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I'm um, sorry if I look tired. I am a little tired today, but not as tired as I normally am. Um, I think it's because I drink quite a bit of coffee. So there's that. I'm going to start with what's in front of me because it's about to poke me. <laughs> I found this. I don't know if you can see it. It is a pumpkin, but then this spins. I haven't seen this. The The middle is like a stained glass, too. So I did pick up two of those. So my yard's going to look pretty festive. With my sunflower um, lights that are out there. Yeah. And the other um, little pumpkin things that I hauled. Mm-hmm. And then I hauled this. Try to get you closer. And this one spins as well. And I got two of these. And the face is glass, like a stained glass too. I don't know if you can see. Turn over on the back. I just thought that was really pretty, especially for a dollar. And hopefully the wind catches them really, really well and they spin. I always love those spinners. Okay, I'm still going to go right here, right in front of me because I have stuff just piled on both sides of me. Uh, I picked up a 2021 calendar and I do have a few calendars that I've got so far for next year. I am so looking forward to next year. So over this year already but this was the one to where it has like the little sticky notes at the bottom it says very important and notes and so I thought like an event calendar like this is the calendar I can hang in our in um, you know oh, the common area where everybody sees it so we can say hey appointment on this day or whatever so I thought we'd do that and I think they're all just probably just the same decoration there that's what I'm assuming it is without opening it um, I did pick up a bag it says celebrate it has sparkly candles on this side and then they're not sparkly on this side and has like the orangey in there. Um, like I said, my niece's birthday is in there too. Like I think her birthday is October 22nd. Riley's is, was the 1st. Charlotte's is the 16th. I think my niece Leandra's is the 22nd of August. Um, and then, yeah, Chase and Gracie and Lila and my daughter and my brother um yeah they're all in september so I, I need bags i've got a few but i thought that one was kind of gender neutral so i can gift it to a male or a female i picked this up it says hey there pumpkin and it's just a really thin rug but it's got the I don't know what you want to call it. Like they're almost a rubbery back. I don't know if it'll slide or not. But if it does, then I have some of that Dollar Tree non-skid stuff. 
to put under it. <coughs> Excuse me. I normally don't drink soda, but I am today. And then, for more for the Halloween, I got these. Get over there. Day of the Dead. Female and male. Oh, those are so cute. Um, they're kind of like a, almost like a cardboard wood, so if I don't put them under the awning or something, they probably won't last more than, more than a year, but I have a big black milk can that I been putting some of that stuff in under the awning so this is all plastic and it says danger keep out and it's a pretty good size I mean this might not hold up sticking down in any kind of you know hard ground but it just says yard stake it's a green bri green briar so made by the Dollar Tree and this one is Beware Go Back. Like I said, they're just a real flimsy plastic, but it's pretty cool. You can make your own little cemetery in your yard. Haha, -ha, I cleared a spot in front of me. Um, I picked this up. I don't know if I've just never paid attention, but I seen this there and it's ortho. Um garden insect killer so I'm sure with any insect killer or weed killer or whatever you need to be careful and follow the directions so this says it kills mites white flies um, all accessible stages of the listed insects and eggs I can use it on flowers fruits vegetables and roses and it's fast-acting which is good. Maybe used up to and including the day of harvest. So that's interesting. Hi buddy, you didn't even realize I was home, huh? You didn't even realize I was home. Come here. Come here. I might be able to pick him up. So you guys can see buddy. Oh my goodness. This is Buddy. He's an old boy. He's like, what is happening? Yeah. Okay. He's uh, really hard of hearing. Ew. And so he didn't realize that I was home until he just woke up and seen me in here. He's like, hey, mom's home. Okay. Which, where do I know? I'm going to do this. Um, I picked up some more of these shortbread cookies. I like the Lorna Dunes, but I like these too. And I think my husband does too. I think he's ate a couple of packs. I really like these and the Lorna Dunes with my coffee. That's like been my candy lately. It's my weakness. Um, my granddaughters love these things. This one is silver too. Yeah. So I picked up two pink and two blue for granddaughters. I mean, poor Chase. He doesn't. He doesn't get a chance. Sorry, I'm gonna reach because I just knocked it off on the floor. He doesn't get a chance for much of this stuff. He's not into this stuff. So, I don't know. Every time I ask him what he wants, like, for his birthday and stuff, it's like a PlayStation card so he can buy guys or something on Fortnite. He tried to explain that stuff to me. I don't understand it. Um, I picked up a pack of these Pampa Mini Teddies. There's honey and chocolate chip. So you get a variety in here. And there's six one-ounce packages. 
that this would be a good little go-to for the grandkids. I've been putting different stuff. I have like um, a gummy pan. I don't know how to explain it. I'm so weird sometimes. But like uh, I have one of them old. It's almost like a Formica pan. You know what? I'm just going to go get it. Forgive me for a minute because I'm talking about it. I have to get it. These. <laughs> this is their gummy pan. Um, and I have it sitting in there so they, they can get it. They have gummies and Scooby Snacks and um, Laffy Taffy. So when they come over, it's totally accessible to them all. Except for Lila, of course. Uh, but yeah, I got a gummy pan. <laughs> I know. I'm strange. <laughs> Sorry, I didn't mean to get up and have dead space, but I couldn't explain it, so I was like, I'll just go get it. I did pick up a couple of pack of these Pop Rocks, and I don't think I'm going to put them in the gummy pan. I think I'm going to put it in the Grimmel Fun Basket, because Chase did, um, whenever we was all at the Dollar Tree here a while back, um, he did, I said, you guys can get two candies, and then I'll buy you a drink. So, he did the Pop Rocks. So, so I got the Pop Rocks assorted, but then I also got the Pop Rocks um, crackling gum. It turns into gum. I'm not sure about that. I don't think I've had it, but I think this is going to go in the Grandma Fun Basket. I picked up this pretty little red bird. And I am not sure what I'm going to do with it yet. I might put it on a flower arrangement for um, the cemetery. Not positive yet. But it was so pretty. And they have the ones with the longer tails and the like glittery things. But I really like this one. It just called to me, I guess. So take me home. I tried to explain all that to my husband. He was not getting it. He was like, oh, Dollar Tree. Straight out of groceries. We're, we're not by any means straight out of groceries. But I just thought this was really cute. I picked up the white pack of the pom-poms. They had the black ones too. But um, I think this year I'm going to have the kids um, make like a little snowman project again. Used to every year. Here, oh, here goes the story again. Used to every year my brother and um, his wife, which is now my ex-sister-in-law, would always invite us over for like a in-between Thanksgiving and Christmas type of dinner and we'd do crafts. And we'd make snowmen. Snowman cookie jars one year. Snowman sock people one year. And I kind of still want to continue to do the craft thing. Since I have the shed. So uh, last year I invited people over to the craft shed. Which it was the first year I had it. And hadn't had it for very long. And, and um, we did some Christmas crafts. So we did a wreath. And I think we made little gnomes. And... You know, really, only my daughter and um, Lila's mommy showed up. But the kids did too. So, long story short, I'm going to have more crafts this year. I am. I'm going to do shed time. I am, I am, I am. I picked up a couple more of the Butter Pecan. I love the smell. It smells so much like fall. And I need to, as soon as we can start turning off fans, I start lighting candles. So I'm looking forward to it. There's that. I found two of these brushes. Um, I'm putting it in, in there for the girls for their um, little makeup thing that's right beside my vanity. Uh, this is a concealer brush. 
Yeah, they'll just use it for whatever. But I've been trying to pick them up whenever I see them. That way there's enough for each girl. Just in case there's more than one girl here at a time wanting to put on makeup. Like the other day they had to take turns. Which is fine. I also picked up some antibacterial wet wipes. And there's 40 in here. So I'm trying to make sure I stay stocked on this. Um, and hand soaps. And toilet paper. And stock your freezer and your pantry. I picked up another one of these because I had been trying to make all the grandkids their own little first aid kit and I'm having a problem finding something to put it in because I got them those round ice packs otherwise I could just put it in one of those little clear containers that have the little slots in it from the Dollar Tree but the round ice packs won't fit in there so I was like I'll get this and I'll, I'll do one up and see how it goes. And if it goes okay, then my husband can always cricket their name on here with first aid kit and Chase's first aid kit or whatever. And then we can go from there. They do have these in black and red that I know of. So I'm going to give that a try. I want to get those first aid kits put together. I got another one of those black handles. It's sitting over there, but I don't know if I'm going to get up and reach again. I'm going to do it. Sorry. Okay. You know what I'm talking about. Those black handles that have the little um, area on the end where you can screw the different attachments on there. I picked up another broom set attachment. This one and this one because I'm wanting to have another broom for outside so I figure three dollars for a broom for outside it's not bad and I hold up for a while too but I didn't want to give up my one for the inside so I didn't <laughs> just gonna say that I got four packs of this every time I go I'm trying to keep up with the with the process there and stay stocked up and they're not limiting right now at the Dollar Tree not on the toilet paper not in some stores some stores I went to they were but there's some stores that aren't which is kind of weird but Okay, and then I picked up two more of the green tea with ginseng and honey. I thought they weren't going to bring the size back again for the summer or whatever, but they did. So I'm trying to stay stocked on that too. I picked up another six pack of the water bottles. Um, I like just the plain. I think my husband's been picking up like the stuff that has like the orange and different flavors to it. I don't want my water already flavored. If I, if I flavor my water, I want it just to be with uh, little flavor packets. So I did pick up another thing of the pizza sauce. I think this pizza sauce is really good. Really good. And so do my grandkids, and I think my kids do too. I did pick up two more cans of the fire roasted diced tomatoes. This is good until June of 2021. These would be gone by then. Now, what's the pizza sauce? April 22nd of 2022. So that's a long time. Let's get a good shelf life right there. So that's pretty good. Ooh, where am I at? Let me see. Um, just a couple more things. I did already buy this. This is a repeat buy, but it's the vinyl top liner and it's just the really light gray 
roses. I used up the other two rolls that I already had just the other day because I got like these square baskets and they're like wicker and they're kind of fraying from use. So I got this and put it down in there to help with the fraying and it looks good. It looks really good. So I was like, you know, I just used that and I'd kind of like to replace it because I have a couple more areas I might use that on. I picked up these LED projector lights and it's supposed to project lighting effects on your ceiling. I picked up a blue one and a purple one. Not sure where these are going to end up. They are battery operated and they take two AAA batteries so that's good. What is that? Oh, and look right there beside it. Two packs of AAA batteries. They are the E Circuit Super Heavy Duty, and they're for low drain devices. So I'm sure that's a low drain device. Yeah. So there's six in each package. Not bad for a dollar. Try to um, stay stocked up on the batteries too. Um, Halloween Deco Glow in the Dark Little Hands. I thought that would be really cool. Put them like on uh, in a window, but but then you have like the black spider webby stuff behind it, and then you stick these in front of it, and so the sun hits it, and then when it turns to night, they glow. That's my thought. I picked up a Stretch Armstrong. I don't know if Chase is going to want this or not, but I feel bad that I can't get stuff that he's interested in. So it's a Flex Flinger. He might. I don't know. But I think I'll probably put that in the Grimmel Fun Basket. Um, uh, let's see. we got a few more minutes. <laughs> I picked up a couple more of these Himalayan salt dial hand soaps. I love these and I go through them quite a bit. Um, I, one is usually at the kitchen sink and one is usually in the bathroom. So we got a couple of these going on and wash your hands, wash your hands. So we're using them up. So I'm trying to stay stocked up. Those were limited in the store I was at. I want to say one store will limit to two and another store will limit to four. It's strange. I found some Barbie um, little pets. I, I guess this is a kitten. This one is a puppy. kitten comes with a little ball of yarn, of course it's plastic, and the puppy comes with a bone. And then there is a little bunny that comes with a carrot. <laughs> I thought that was really cute. Um, I'm going to go ahead and stop right here. Um, I might go ahead and just keep filming so I'll have another one to upload for you later just in case I don't get time. But I just want to say that I really appreciate you guys sticking around. I hope you give me a thumbs up. And I am going to have my husband make that for me. <laughs> and then if you haven't subscribed, subscribe. And if, if you do, make sure you hit the bell button. And that will tell you whenever I upload a video. Like I said, they're kind of random. I'm trying to get better. Um, I, I love doing it. I love shopping. It's my favorite thing to do. But... Um, I like getting deals more than I like just shop shopping. So if I can get a good deal, I'm like, <laughs> so anyways, I do have a couple more Dollar Tree hauls and, um, I have a thrift store, I have a little bit of a rummage and I have a very small Hobby Lobby again. So with that being said, I hope everybody is staying safe and taking care. So I will catch you later.